In this video, we'll show you how to remove your hard drive and replace it with a new solid state hard drive using the Toshiba SSD kit. As part of this process, we'll also show you how to transfer your data from your existing hard drive to your new solid state drive. The Toshiba SSD kit comes with all the required hardware and software needed to transfer your data from your existing hard drive to your new solid state hard drive. Included in the kit are the Toshiba solid state drive preloaded with PC data migration software, a USB to SATA transfer cable recommended for use only with Toshiba SSDs, a desktop bracket and screws for use with desktop computers, a CD-ROM containing PC data migration software, user's manual and warranty information, a SATA data cable, and a SATA power cable. Before starting the transfer process, Connect your AC adapter to the computer and power outlet. Don't perform this transfer with your laptop running off its battery. Make sure you have a clean, dry area to work and that your computer is powered down. Also, even though the migration software is designed to copy all of your data, it's always a good idea to back up your data before beginning this process. First, open the Toshiba Solid State Drive PC Upgrade Kit box and lay the contents by your work area. Then, connect the solid state drive to the SATA connector on the USB to SATA conversion cable. Connect the two USB connectors of the USB to SATA conversion cable to your computer's USB ports. Make sure you connect both USB connectors. Next, turn on your computer and make sure no programs or applications are running. Insert the disk that came with your upgrade kit into the drive and run the installer for the data migration software NTI Echo. After installing the application, run NTI Echo by double-clicking on the shortcut on the desktop and clicking Yes on the user account control prompt. Follow the on-screen instructions to continue the installation and perform the migration. If the hard drive you are replacing has a larger capacity than the new solid-state hard drive, you may have to use the filters provided in the migration software. Note, this process may take a long time. You'll be prompted to power down at the end of the process. Now, with the computer powered down, disconnect the USB cables from the computer and the SATA cable from the solid state hard drive. Then, disconnect the computer's AC adapter cable and, if using a laptop, remove the battery. You can now remove the original internal hard drive and install the solid state hard drive in its place. Note that for a laptop, you may need to save and reuse the bracket and screws that are on the old drive. For a desktop computer, we provide the bracket and necessary screws and cables. Place the battery back into the computer if using a laptop, and reconnect the power. You can now power on your computer and begin normal use. For more information, visit support.toshiba.com.